everyone, and welcome back to Zombie Horse. We've got a crappy pasta reading for you today, tonight, because it's supposed to be dark out. If it's not dark out, watch anyway. Our first story is the supermarket monster. I'll begin. Once in a place far away, a very long time ago, there was an boy named Roger. He was an boy. An boy. An boy so named Roger. He was just an boy. Okay. I'll, I'll try not to interrupt. Yeah, I get it. If they make these grammatical errors, I don't see any you're grammatical just, errors. You're just gonna read them how it is. Yeah, I'm reading okay. them exactly how they are. All right. He was tall, but a bit round. Roger was a bit round. He lived in a big city where unusual things seemed to happen every day. For example, his uncle died. That's fucking... That's strange. <laughs> that never happens. <laughs> anyway, Roger had lots of enemies. E-N-I-M-E-S. For... <laughs> unusual things happen every day. For example, his uncle died. This is... Have you ever lost anyone? My grandma. That's unusual. I think some other people too. Yeah. But they weren't really relevant enough for me to care. That's fucking unusual, man. That's super unusual. <laughs> Although I'm just I'm just miming out the story. Yeah. Anyway, Roger had lots of enemies in the city. All the people he used to like were now his enemies because he changed. He used to be <clears throat> He that wasn't in the story, by the way. He used to be a really <laughs> <laughs> He used to be a really successful banker named Ron. Successful has only one of the two S's that is required near the end of the word. But he decided to go another way, and now he is a hobo named Roger. So it's kind of like a transgender. Like, maybe they switched the name. He went from successful to hobo, so he changed his name from Ron to Roger. Roger's more of a homeless name. Because of this, his friends thought they didn't like him anymore. So they said, you're our enemy now! And Roger was like, oh no, I have no friends but loads of enemies. Roger lives day two tomorrow by the change he gets off strangers outside McDonald's, but sometimes he... When he I gets... I don't know how to act that one out. Yeah, the, the fucking... I'm fucking oh. all fucked in the head. When he gets enough money, he goes to the local shopping center called Teco. He can only buy things when they are on sale. So he only buys things when they are on sale because he doesn't have any much money. <laughs> that wasn't fucking redundant as fucking hell. Sometimes he even gets enough change to buy chicken when it's on sale. And he goes into KFC and says, can you cook this for me? And they do it because they are his enemies and spit in the food yuck. <laughs> <laughs> Today, on the most windy and stormy and rainy and cloudy and sad of days, that's a lot of ands, he decided he needed to eat and went to Teco. When he went inside, there was no baskets. This was weird. It's one of those unusual things, like your uncle dying. This was weird. Roger thought, thought that that must be give, giving with an E still in there them a break today, so he kept going. He saw that Thray Bread was on sale, so he was going to buy it. Then an big fat hairy man ran up to him and said, No, that not for you. And he took the sale sign away, which made the bread go back up to $100,000. <laughs> How? Why is this bread $100,000 fucking dollars? This is expensive bread. This is fucking. It's Asiago. This is uh, that Asiago the fountain of youth bread. Yeah. It was. This is maybe it's that Elven bread from Lord of the yeah, Rings. Yeah, that's right. It'll last you months. It'll last you months forever. It's a whole loaf. This is all in the future, so that's normal for the future. That thanks for fucking telling us that at the beginning of the fuck. Did he even mention that this is? No! Once in a place far away, a very long time ago, he said. Whoa, you're getting off track. I was getting into the store. What the fuck? Bread's he said. $100, then he said it's the future. <laughs> Roger made a face similar to this, <laughs> and then he puts an, an emoticon. What is it? Can I see it? Yeah, it's um, it's the, the D. 
the D right here. Is this it? Yeah, that's it. That's it. You're really good at that. And he said, but if you don't give me that, I will stri str striv. And the fat man laughed and his and his fat went bouncy from laughing. <laughs> then one of Ron's enemies died. So Ron felt his anger rising. What the fuck? That happens when his enemies die. He And he punched the man, Manan, so hard that his fat fell off. And the man was so angry that he cried blood. Then the lights went out so fast that Roger knew he was going to be murdered. A black mist came out of the cereal boxes and the- <laughs> <laughs> That was it for you, huh? Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> that was it, that was it. A black mist came out of the cereal boxes. The visual I got of that, like- Yeah, a, yeah. Just like, ooh. Yeah, I know, ooh. <laughs> fucking peanut butter Captain Crunch. <laughs> And the bacon was flying everywhere, pancake mix splashing over the counters, freezers freezing at higher temperature at... <laughs> freezers freezing at higher temperature. Holy fucking shit. That... <sighs> freezers freezing at higher temperature, that... No First of all, he put temperature. That normal. So that it was freezing the frozen pizzazzas too much. Ron, Ron, <laughs> Ron ran away. Ron, Ron ran way far away to the aisle. That's always full of people. It has like loads of sweets and crips. Crips. Like, like the gang? Like the gang. It's written like the gang. Um. Yummy. There was like 10, no wait, 15 monsters there. So he was like there. He's like, there was 10. No wait, there was 15. I counted. All black with eyes, oogieing with blood, and tears that looked like bacon, but were actually dead people's skin. Imagine... <laughs> imagine... Imagine... Crying bacon strips? That would this, suck. I'm getting, honestly... It's the, creepy, right? The thing, about, the thing about these really shitty stories yeah is even though the grammar is terrible and yeah. the stories are weird it's just the visuals you get are the visuals are they're powerful. so creative right they're very creative they are so creative he screamed fat man help but when the fat man came her he said you punch my fat and now you will pay is that the end no oh. he put like 40 ellipses so i guess we have to wait oh okay so that's done. So you pretty much no further in Bloodborne. You played it for like eight hours and you're no further. I got to the sewer. Yeah. And died by a giant pig in the sewer. <clears throat> All right. I am your enemy. This is a few more ellipses to go through. Yeah, I'm really, I'm really, I had, wasn't I had, that long, wasn't that oh, long okay. in ellipses. And then he ran and went inside a freezer, but forgot that the freezers froze too hard now. And he died from freeze. Roger ran to an exit and was almost out when he tripped on something. He looked down and saw his enema, enemy saying, help me, the pancakes were too string. And then he said, no, I am Roger. You were Ron's friend, not mine, Smelly. And he ran out the door. He was safe. He got out. He escaped. He avoided death. He was alive. He was tall. He was safe. He was Roger. Then he went he back in for the bread, but forgot about the monsters. So when he got the bread, the monsters came out between the slices and cried blood from their mouth, saying, We are your enemies, Ron. He said, How do you know my old name? And then they ate him, and he just fell down on the floor, crying from death. His last words were, I am all your enemies. Then he fell down and died. Just before he died, he said, I will now be a supermarket monster. So when you are in a supermarket, remember that Ron is waiting. In the future, though, because it's in the future, remember? That's the end. Credit goes to Phoebe C. I liked it. The ending was a little... 
left a little bit to be desired. The, the ending went kind of left field, but um, I like I did like it. Yeah, yeah, that was uh, that was a powerful one. Thanks, thanks so much for watching. Thank you. Subscribe to uh, yeah, Zombie Horse. Yeah, subscribe to Zombie Horse.